The cleanup is lasting longer than expected in Selma, which fell victim to severe weather two weeks ago. It was a little over a year ago. A tornado also wreaked havoc on the city, destroying much of downtown. We sent our Monet Stevens to Selma for an update on the recovery. Really? Again? You know, it's like this is happening again. That was Mayor James Perkins Jr.'s first thought after a storm blew through Selma almost two weeks ago. It was really a rushed storm. The storm caused significant damage to a few houses across town, knocked down trees and caused a power outage for 12,000 customers in Dallas County. Mayor Perkins says luckily the cleanup from this storm was swift, although they could not get any assistance from the government. It was not sufficient enough to get disaster recovery support from state FEMA or the federal uh, government. This is the fourth time that Selma has been impacted by inclement weather within the last four years. The mayor says it keeps taking a toll on the city's finances. The mayor is calling for some form of legislation at either the state or federal level to help rural communities like Selma recover quicker from natural disasters and be able to sustain their municipal budget. It's not a question of if it's going to happen again. It's a question of when. Monet Stevens, WSFA 12 News, Selma. Churches, the American Red Cross, and other nonprofit groups are helping many Selma homeowners repair damage to their homes.